by defeating Marshall 41 to 24 on Saturday, December the 7th. And whereas Coach David Bailey was recognized for one of the best seasons in Rice history. You know, that, that was exciting to come to Commissioner's Court with Judge Emmett, the commissioners, and uh, I think it was really exciting for the players just to be recognized for what they've accomplished this year for the city of Houston to proclaim Rice Owl Day. I mean, you know, that's uh, pretty That's pretty nice to be recognized that way. Yeah, I mean, you get caught up while you're in school thinking it's just about, you know, your, your team and the, you know, the students also, but it does mean a lot to a lot of people, that, to alumni that have pulled for Rice teams that didn't win a lot of games for years. And so it's, again, it's just, it's nice to make everyone proud, and that's, I think that's the biggest thing. Just have this kind of recognition and, and honor in this kind of way from people outside the direct Rice community, you know, just to see this, this, this kind of feedback is really, really encouraging. Yeah, that's what Gabe was talking about, just some of the different county judges and the commissioners that are former Rice Owls, and, you know, like the mayor is a Rice Owl also, and it's, it's funny, you get out and about in the city and you just start to network and you realize how many different Rice Owls are in different prominent positions around the city, which is pretty cool. Yeah, it really has to sink in, yeah, so. I'm so worried. Like, you know, I'm so worried about Mississippi State and what we're gonna do. But I'm sure after seeing that, I'm gonna be happy to be able to celebrate this one. Here's our team. December 31st, we we'll all we can do to bring this city home with a Liberty Bowl victory, and we appreciate all the hard work you did to do, all of you commissioners and judge, to make Harris County and Houston the greatest city in the world. Thank you very much. For